Hello everyone. In this video we shall study about the procedure and calculation and report for synthesis of tristhiourea zinc 2 sulfate complex. This is a part of experiment in your B.Sc. Chemistry 3rd year that is 6th SEM paper 8. If you look at the equation we are going to add zinc sulfate heptahydrate to thiourea in presence of concentrated HCl to get a tetrahedral complex tristhiourea zinc 2 sulfate. It is a neutral complex because we have three organic ligands they bear no charge and sulfate ions bear two minus charge zinc has two plus charge so the total charge on the complex becomes zero. Zinc 2 plus ion is a 3D10 system and hence we have vacant 4s and 4p orbitals. They combine to give sp3 hybrid orbitals that is 4s and 4p combine to give 4 sp3 hybrid orbitals. We know sp3 hybridization will have a tetrahedral geometry. So these hybrid orbitals will be filled with the electrons given by the donors thiourea and sulphate ions. Hence we have a tetrahedral geometry for tris thiourea zinc 2 sulphate complex. Coming to the procedure of this experiment weigh 0.5 grams of zinc sulphate heptahydrate to this add 5 ml of water we get a solution. To this solution add 2 to 3 drops of concentrated hydrochloric acid. You get another solution, solution 2. To that you add urea 0.5 grams and then if you do not see the crystals you can add ice. The complex will crystallize out. The crystals need to be then filtered and washed with acetone, dried and weighed. Coming to the calculation part, we have the molecular weight of the complex is 287.66. If we were to take one molecular weight of zinc sulphate to prepare the complex which is 389.66 grams, that is 287 will give you 389 grams of the complex. But we have started with 0.5 grams of zinc sulphate and hence the theoretical yield will be 0.5 into 389.66 divided by 287.66 that is 0.67 grams. We would have weighed the complex and that will become the observed yield which we have prepared. Percentage yield is equal to observed yield by theoretical yield into 100. So we have to do this calculation and then finally report the percentage of tris thiourea zinc 2 sulphate complex is dash. Now let us perform the experiment. I have weighed 0.5 grams of zinc sulphate and 0.5 grams of thiourea and here you have 5 ml of water. We need a beaker. We are going to take zinc sulphate first, put it in the beaker and then I am going to add water. So now I have now I have got solution 1. To this I am supposed to add concentrated HCl which I shall add and then I am going to add thiourea. Okay, I have added concentrated HCl and thiourea here. Now I am going to stir it. So you can see here without adding ice I have got complex. A nice yield of complex. See? So you need not add ice. Now we are supposed to filter this. 
for that I have kept the filtration stand ready. We have to put water and wet it first. The filter paper needs to be wetted. And now transfer the precipitate, this complex and filter it. We have micro scaled the experiments in order to minimize wastage. You know that. So you have to be very careful in performing this experiment. The way you wash it, everything becomes important here. We have got sufficient amount of complex there. Now we are supposed to wash it with acetone. So acetone removes adhering water and drying will become very easy for us. After this I am going to remove it, dry it, weigh it and then we shall look at the calculation part. After weighing the complex the observed yield was 0.6 grams. Hence the percentage yield was found to be 88.62. Finally the report will be the percentage of Tris thiourea zinc 2 sulphate complex is equal to 88.62. Hope you have understood this practical well. We have already performed this. This is just a revision. If you have any doubts, you can contact me or leave a message here. Thank you.